So the city council deals with a, a wide range of issues throughout the year. But in particular, we have an interest in focusing on um, things that are current in the way of issues. And so each year we have a council retreat, generally early in our year, we had one in January this year, where we talk about some of the most pressing issues that are facing Salt Lake City, immediate issues and long-term broad issues. And we uh, try to develop some priorities that we can spend some extra time focusing on during the year in order to accomplish some of those bigger picture issues. So last year for our priorities, council chose affordable housing, economic development, and infrastructure, uh, mostly as it relates to the condition of our streets and curb and gutter and sidewalk. We worked a lot last year on homelessness and affordable housing. We spent a great deal of time on that. And when we started looking at these issues in January, the council felt as a body felt pretty strongly that we still had a lot more work to do. And so we carried forward those priorities from last year into this year, and we are um, focusing on the same sort of things. Uh, we got a lot accomplished last year in homelessness and in economic development with our new economic development department, but we didn't have the time that we wanted to dedicate to our infrastructure needs. Um, so we've sort of rearranged those priorities a little bit this year. Affordable housing still our number one priority. Infrastructure is number two and economic development has dropped to three, but we hope to spend a lot of time on each of those areas. So as we're looking at our priorities from a council perspective, what we're really looking at are policy and funding direction that will be important to support the priorities that we develop in those policies. So in order to have affordable housing, what policies do we need to have in the city? What financial support do we need to make sure affordability can happen? And we'll be talking to uh, residents all through the year very specifically about what their ideas are in all of these areas. When we get to our infrastructure conversation, we will want to hear from the public What's the priority? Is it streets? Is it sidewalks? Is it curb and gutter? What do you want to see us invest in? How much money do you, are you willing to invest in? Over what time frame? So all of that will be a very public conversation through the year. We encourage public input. In fact, uh, we hope we get a lot of public input on all of these uh, three topics. Um, people can participate by coming to a council meeting and sharing your thoughts. Uh, people can communicate to us through um, email or through formal letters. All of that information is available on our website, um, slcgov.com. We will also have opportunities to participate through Open City Hall and potentially some surveys that we might send out to the community. So we encourage people to share their feelings with us in any way that's most convenient for them.